Yo guys, what's up? It's Cherry here, coming at you guys with a sword, not sword and shield, we're out of that era, with a scarlet and violet Pokemon Wi-Fi battle, yes. Um, here we are, I'm finally here. Um, now, I'm not really the best at smoke on stuff, um, and like OU and things like that. I'm a draft player, uh, so I suck at building teams for like, a meta like this where there are so many pokemon that you have to prep for and think about when you're playing uh but i decided hey you know what i want to do it so here we are here is a team that i tested on showdown that i am using it has a lot of interesting parts into it it has palafin which is by the way one of my favorite pokemon to come out in this uh, generation i love dolphins i've only i've only had good experience with dolphins um so i love it so much it's so cute and it's i'm so glad it's good in mons too but uh we have palafin that was kind of like the the thing that i wanted to like build around but kind of not really um we have dragapult we have an offensive spell tag dragapult uh i wanted to run a willow hex set a bulky willow hex set um but unfortunately i don't have the willow tm and it's kind of hard to get bait nets and shumpets so we're just going to rock with it. We have a Roaring Moon. Kind of same deal. I would love to have Iron Head or Acrobatics instead of Flamethrower. But unfortunately, I don't have the means to get it. So we're rocking with Flamethrower and Booster Energy. Uh, so that we can get our plus one immediately. Then we have Iron Treads and Assault Vest. It's kind of an Assault Vest offensive Iron Treads um, here. With Ice Spinner. Good to catch uh, what grass types, bulky grasses in. We have Amoongus. Yes, you see it. Amoongus. Amoongus helps check Palafin. Uh, it's also a really good pivot with Spore and kind of coming in and just doing what Amoongus does. We have Choice Bandit Palafin, which is kind of self-explanatory. And then we have Screamtail. Now, the reason why I have Screamtail, I haven't really seen a lot of Screamtail. Um, this team loses to Iron Bundle. Iron Bundle, I lie to you not, literally clicks freeze dry and hydro pump and kills literally everything on the team right so since i suck at making teams i didn't really know how to go about this so i just brought screamtail like screamtail can come in i did some calcs uh, my set is designed to not get to it ko'd by uh booster energy iron bundle hydro pump uh, even after rocks, which is really, really nice. Um, I can come in and I can potentially Terra if I need to uh, as a defensive move, or I can just use it as a bulky pivot. So yeah, this is pretty much the team. Um, I'm probably going to be using this team for the next couple of videos because it's kind of hard to grind stuff out right now to make new teams. Uh, but if you guys have any suggestions on how to make this team better outside of Dragapult, this this is the Dragapult set I can afford right now. Um, definitely let me know in the comment section down below. But uh, yeah, here we go. And I hope to see you guys at the battle. And we are back. And looking at their team they have the new poison bug they have mouse hold which all i know about that mon is it gets a complete demo it's not complete demolition population bomb which hits 10 times i think i'm not sure like in rock dusk we have the protein grass starter which i know has a move that always crits being flower trick dragapult and gudra so looking at this team I'm really liking Screamtail lead, um, but I'm also liking Amoongus lead because Amoongus can lead well against the Grass Starter. It can lead against Lycanroc. It can lead against Moss Hold. Um, Gudra is not that big of an issue because I have Screamtail. Uh, I actually really, 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 really like Amoongus lead here. And yeah, here we go. 20 minute timer. We like have fun. I've actually played on 20 minute timer here and I've never timered, so hopefully we can keep it that way. Also, can I just say the music? I'm so glad we can have the, the music in here. They lead Moss Hold, okay. I'm actually just gonna click Sludge Bomb. I feel like Sludge Bomb is a no drawback play. 
You go for Population Bomb. Okay. So I am Fizz Defamungus. This is actually doing a lot of damage. Oh, Lord. Oh, my God. It just did all my health. Okay. All right. Well, I got a Poison with Sludge Bomb. That's phenomenal. You might be Choice Banned. Is that Choice Banned? I don't know. I'm not sure. Um... I have to switch out because I need to keep this for the Grass Starter and Lycanroc. So I'm going to make the aggressive play into Dragapult here. Hopefully, uh, I, I think this thing gets U-turn. I'm not too sure. Okay, they go for Population Bomb again. Perfect. Now, let's see. What's free here? I could drop a Draco. Draco is extremely free. And then... Yeah, I actually like dropping a Draco. Draco's extremely free here. Okay, yep. Then they sack. That's beautiful. So down goes Mouse Hold. That did so much damage. Like, hello? Please don't do that much damage ever again. Thank you. Okay, they pivot into the Grass Starter. Okay. So... I mean, I have no choice. I have to go back into Amoongus. Hopefully... I think this thing gets knockoff. Hopefully, knockoff doesn't do too much damage. Play rough. Okay, perfect. So now I'm actually going to take the time to click synthesis. Even though I do get regen, um, I need this thing healthy. Because there's still a Lycan Rock there. And I feel like you should feel for a Night Slash. Okay. Get off the synthesis here. I heal 50% of my health, which is nice. Uh, and then I can go for. A super effective sludge bomb this turn because you don't have a steel type on this team so it's very free i feel like you could pivot into maybe gudra but i have screen tail for that you do switch out you could also pivot into the poison bug is it a poison bug i don't know it looks like one there it is yeah that thing i have no idea what it is i just know that you're poison type <laughs> Okay, so pivoting into Scream Tail is like the least, like the last thing I want to do. I actually think I want to pivot into Iron Treads here. I don't know if you're ground type. No, well, not ground type. I mean flying. You're not flying because it's staying super effective. So I'm going to go into Iron Treads. Iron Treads is kind of like meh in this matchup. It's not horrible. I mean, it helps Lycanroc. I don't know if Lycanroc lost close combat or not, but we're going to see. Uh, you don't have an Earthquake Immunity. I'm just going to click EQ. No need to predict. And this thing is dead. Nice. Here. Alright. Gudra comes in. I'm tempted to click Ice Spinner. I, yeah, I'm tempted to click Ice Spinner, but then at the same time, um, I want to keep this healthy. And also, Screen Tail kind of has no use except for checking Gudra and Dragapult. So I might as well just use it for what it's intended for. And I can go for a free Dazzling Gleam because Agua Tail. Okay. That did a lot. Oh, that was a crit. Okay. And your Life Orb. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, I'm... Do I want to get my rocks up? I don't think so. I don't think there's any point in getting rocks up. No, there's really not. I can Dazzling Gleam here. Dragon Ball looks really, really good for this in-game. I outspeed. Oh, yeah, I am pretty fast. And you go for Sludge Bomb. This is going to do a decent amount. Yeah, that did a decent amount. Life Orb Chip plus Dazzling Gleam is going to really, really help. The fact that this thing is really, really bulky is pog. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to go for another Dazzling Gleam. I'm actually going to sack this to this. My Terra type is Psychic, uh, so I'm super... Dragapult hits me... Oh, wow. Okay, Power Whip. Dragapult hits me super effectively anyway, and I'm too low to even do anything at that range. So, I could go into Palafin and click Flip Turn. 
Or I can just go Dragon Pool and click Shadow Ball. That also works. I like that idea. <laughs> Unfortunately, I'm not Terra Ghost. If I was Terra Ghost, I would Terra right now. But unfortunately, I'm Terra Rock, as you guys can see. But yep, can go for a free Shadow Ball. If they pivot into the Grass Starter, I can always just pivot a Moongus. I don't see a drawback into pivoting into a Moongus. They're, I'm assuming their like hardest hitting Dark Stab is Night Slash, and as you guys like saw earlier, it didn't do much damage. This is the Lycan Rock. Okay. Uh, I think I'm going to U-turn out on this. If it's Scarf, then it's Scarf. I have a lot of, like, potential win cons. You terastalize this. Okay. Are you Terra Rock type? Terra Ice type. Ooh. Okay. Well, there goes Amoongus being my check to this. Terra Blast could be really, really annoying. Like, extremely annoying. Uh, and if you guys don't know, Terra Blast actually is kind of like Photon Geyser, but it's less power, and it, it's based off of your type. Oh, this is not fun. Okay, um, I could go Palafin. Palafin should live, and then I can Jet Stream, like I can Terra Water. You have your the Grass Starter, which I can 1v1 with Amoongus, and then you have Dragapult. Dragapult, this isn't really good against Dragapult. So, I could also Roaring, I could also Terra with Roaring Moon instead. Because then, like, I for sure can clean up. Terra Blast, yep, I had a feeling. I can't pivot into a Moongus. Yeah. Alright. I think I'm gonna go for a flip turn. I should live any hit from this. Actually, or do I wanna just go for jet punches? If I die to this, then I can freely go into iron treads and I should be fine. I get crit, that's unfortunate. Um, I also should outspeed this with Roaring Moon. Or no, I'm not jolly on that. So I can pivot into iron treads here. If you're close combat, I should live one hit. And I'm just gonna go for an Earthquake. Or I can go for a Heavy Slam. Yeah, I'm just gonna go for a Heavy Slam here. You go for Crunch, I should eat this. Yeah, I eat that. Yep. And then you die, perfect. Okay. So you have Dragapult left. And you have the Grass Starter left. So, Roaring Moon can clean up this game for me. Which is nice. Reliable partner. I feel like that's a grass starter. Yes, it is. Alright. They might U-turn, and if they do U-turn, Iron Treads is my sack. Iron Treads kind of really did its job. Took out Revenge Kill the Lycan Rock, which is nice. I just need a free switch into Roaring Moon, and Roaring Moon should be able to clean it up for me. Flower trick. Okay, this shouldn't do a lot. Yeah, that does nothing. That did 20 damage. And I heal most of that from Black Sludge. I'm gonna Sludge Bomb here. Sludge Bomb's free. You don't have a resist. Unless Dragon resists Poison, which I doubt. Yeah, so you switch out here. I could have clicked Spore. But... Yep, Dragapult comes in. I can maybe get a poison. I do not get a poison. I'm actually okay with taking damage on this and just getting off a spore. If I spore, you're guaranteed to turn asleep. Then I can go Roaring Moon and then I can Terra. I like this idea. I'm gonna spore. I should still be able to check the. Okay, Dragon Darts, that's fine. I should still be able to check the Grass Starter. Also, since you're darts, I'm fizz deaf, so that really didn't do anything. Okay, here we go. Alright. So now, now that you are asleep, I am going to just pivot into Roaring Moon. 
if you switch out into okay you don't switch out okay sweet so you're guaranteed to turn to sleep roaring moon comes in get the booster energy and then i can terra into a dark type so that darts isn't super effective just in case you wake up and then I should be able to just win the game out right here. Dragon Claw is free. Yeah, because that covers for the switch in. Just in case. But yeah, this should be game over here. Wow, Terra Dark looks so gorgeous. I actually don't want this to be Terra Dark. I actually want it to be another type. But Terra Dark, the colors with this. So you do wake up, so I'm glad I terra Phantom Force. Okay. I'm actually gonna Dragon Dance this turn. Phantom Force shouldn't do like anything to me. Yeah, that actually did more than I would have hoped, but Dragon Dance, and then this should just be, I can click Dragon Claw twice. I should outspeed you now. You're not Scarf, because you clicked darts before. Yep. And then the grass starters can come in, and then I can Dragon Claw, and then that should be game. I really, really, really like this team. I also haven't been running into a lot of Iron Bundles. The Iron Bundle's so scary. But perfect, that is going to be GG's to my opponent. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Please, 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 if you can, um, if you have any suggestions on how to make my team. Also, that was a 6-0. It was? I don't remember it being a 6-0. I think it's just the, the mons on the screen. But if you guys have any, any suggestions for the team, definitely let me know. Um, and with that being said, I'm going to get the heck up out of here. And I hope all of you guys have a fantastic day. Bye-bye.